Hello everybody, it's Tanya from Dolly Day's Nursery and I have a blanket reveal. This is a custom baby and it is little tiny Caleb. So I just finished um, building her and um, this is Sunday, January 13th, 2019 and she was just born at four o'clock and I believe here in Newfoundland it's about 410 about right now so I just finished weighing her and she is a tiny one pound six ounces so I'm just gonna hit go ahead and reveal her she's not dressed or anything so this is how she is without her clothes she is so tiny and adorable. I um, painted her hair and I guess I <clears throat> challenged myself to stretch my abilities. So this is her painted hair. It's the first time I went so dramatic. <laughs> with her hair and even with her eyebrows instead of giving uh, just the faint or uh, barely there look I gave her the full-on full eyebrows to match her <laughs> full head of hair <laughs> and she is very sweet with her rooted eyelashes and her signed bum. <laughs> so she does have a neck ring which will make for easier um, movements. And she's also going to a child. So I varnished her three times just uh, to give extra coatings to the paint for extra protection. I don't think she's going to be playing with her an awful lot. Um, I think it's more of a keepsake. She won't be playing with her right now anyway. She is going to be a first birthday gift. So it's her first um, major doll. <laughs> and um, so until she's old enough to play with her but you know I don't know when when that will be and as added protection I also uh, sealed the limbs inside uh, just in case at some point the limb gets pulled off or the head gets pulled off I um, did my routine of course these limbs don't take very much product <laughs> and um, I did my routine with that and stuffed the end with some um, polyfill but then I went even further and I used the E6000 glue and I sealed that then I cut a um, circle out of cardboard and I placed that in and stuffed it in even further and then I sealed it, the full thing, with glue again so that there will be no chance of anything spilling out at the time of playing or anything with her. So just to, to be that little extra cautious. And she has the neck ring so the head won't as easy be uh, able to pop off. And so yeah, that is her. Now, I do have her little outfit I'm going to put on her. So again, a little baby alive diaper. <clears throat> I wish I had a little onesie to go on her, but uh, she's so tiny. And uh, the person I done the custom for wanted to keep the cast down. So we're just going with the, the bare basics here. And uh, see how this diaper just perfectly it's it's just some cute 
Now I'm going to fold down that back because it's extra long. The only thing about these diapers is that it is the old fashioned sticky type. So it has this plastic here. You can remove it, but it's not like the Velcro ones. So there we go in that. She is ready with her diaper. And the other thing was socks. I don't have socks for her. In between now and receiving the rest of the payment, I just might um, try to recreate, downsize a pair of socks to uh, put on her little piggies. There we go. Uh, this outfit is actually, <clears throat> I got it at Walmart. It's actually the uh, the My Life clothes for dolls. And um, I find them to be perfect for these uh, little mini dolls. They're great. And also has Velcro on the back. So that really makes it better for small children to dress and undress their baby dolls. So I think that's great. Of course, my, uh, I, I am not happy with the uh, three quarter limb body, but because the arms are so, the shoulders are so puffy, it just, that irritates me, but this outfit fits her perfectly. Oh my gosh. And of course, as I always do, uh, a ponytail holder for the headband. So there you go, everybody. Here is, I don't want to say Caleb because <laughs> Caleb is a boy. Sorry. And she also has her little tiny mini teddy bear to go with her. She's just too sleepy. She doesn't want to bother with a teddy bear. And her little bottle. So there you go. That is baby Caleb. <laughs> I'm going to say baby C. <laughs> because she is now a girl. But anyway, everybody, thank you for joining me. I'll just pick her up and let you uh, see. Let me see her details, her little hands. And her little fingers and her nails are all done. Her little, little feet. Oops, we're going blurry. There. And of course, she might be tiny, but she still has all the proper mottling and, and veining. All the realistic veining. And her sweet face. <laughs> she is just precious. So I'm actually shipping her straight to the child for her birthday. Um, so the person who actually ordered her is not going to physically be able to see her. So I'm going to take some nice photos and... Um, forward them to her and uh, then she can see see her but I'm sure once once they open her for the birthday they'll take pictures there as well so hopefully I will uh, get a picture back <laughs> and be able to share it on my page or on my website and um, then you can all See that as well. So thank you everybody for joining me and uh, 
wishing this little girl a happy birthday. Today is her birthday, born just moments ago. So anyway, take care, everybody. Hope you like uh, the video. And if you have not subscribed, make sure you subscribe so that you will uh, see upcoming videos. And uh, I will see you soon. Take care.